Breaking news from uh, Kate McCann about another departure from the Cabinet. Yeah, we're just looking at a tweet. I'm looking at a tweet here from Robert Jenrick, the Secretary of State for Housing, Communities and Local Government. He's posted that in the last minute, saying, it's been a huge privilege to serve as Secretary of State. Thank you to everyone at the department for their hard work, dedication and friendship. I'm deeply proud of all we achieved. I will continue to support the Prime Minister and the government in every way I can. Now, that's very similar to the Gavin Williamson tweet that we talked about earlier on. Again, a suggestion that he's been removed from that job but not given another one. I will continue to support the Prime Minister and the government in every way I can is an indication that he doesn't have a job formally in government anymore at all. Again, another big name, another big change. And while we're talking about all of this, remember we said that Dominic Raab went in to the House of Commons, we believe. We understand that he went in to see the Prime Minister Boris Johnson, but we've not yet heard anything about what happened in that meeting. It's been quite a while now. You know, there are some who would say, is that because the Prime Minister is in there talking to him potentially about another job? You know, we've, we've talked in the past about when some ministers say they don't want to move, they may well just refuse altogether. Potentially, these messages that we're seeing on Twitter, Robert Jamrick and Gavin Williamson, are also ministers who've been offered something else but have just flat out refused it. And that's why we're seeing this kind of wording. When and, we, and we do know Dominic Raab is, is with the Prime Minister at the moment and the Prime Minister, we think, uh, in Westminster, in, in Parliament still. We understand so, yes. There was some speculation that he might be back in Downing Street, but my understanding is he's very much still in the House of Commons. We haven't heard anything yet from Dominic Raab or any of those around him about what's happened as a result of that meeting, so we can only assume that he is still talking to Boris Johnson. The big question is, a conversation that long usually suggests that somebody's maybe been offered a job, maybe they don't want to take it, maybe they're having a conversation about whether there are any alternative options. This is all speculation right now. We are not in the room. Those two men potentially are. We'll, of course, bring everything to you as soon as we have it.